so what we're doing today is we're celebrating all the achievements of the Guardian Scholars. We're celebrating all the successes that they've, they've had this semester. So what we're doing is just we're treating them to a nice uh, barbecue lunch, some awards, some recognitions, and just let them know that this is just the beginning of something big. Right? We, we want to know how your experience in Guardian Scholars has been so far. It's been the best thing ever happened to me because we never had this before. So this is an opportunity for everybody to come in, you know, not just be recognized, but to say, hey, we're here, we belong to someone. I'm Jessica Lorenz Guardian Scholars. Scholarly Council and EOPS Council. Uh, we just want you to know that we're here to support you during finals week, before finals week, after finals. Um, remember that if you're an EOPS student, we have Scantrons and Blue Books. Cool. I'm not going to use the microphone, but I just want to see how it sounded. <laughs> And we got a special, a couple of little certificates for a few students that wanted to specifically recognize because they went a little above and beyond this semester and doing great things in the community and also transferring out and also uh, being accepted on the English. So, as Alberto has the certificate to, um, to Florentino, he's going to hand it to you and bam, we get the picture. Yeah. Yeah. Make it official. Thank you. Thank you. Awesome. We might be able to go out selfie. Yeah, Dorian will be receiving her certificate in child development. Did you? <laughs> what school did you choose, Unit? I'm a Bruin! Oh. Oh. program and I am so inspired by it. It's going to change my life. And under the umbrella of AOPS we have Guardian Scholars and KPs. So we have two different separate programs for foster youth. So we meet all of the foster youth's needs on our campus through one of those two programs. It's going to be able to empower other foster youth to also continue to break barriers and to continue to, you know, make the best out of their situation so that they can create opportunities for other students that are coming with a similar type of story. I think this program is amazing because it gives youth, especially foster youth, a sort of second chance at reinventing themselves, reinventing their lives. Yeah. Okay. And attributed a lot of my success and without it I would definitely not be successful. It's done a lot of good things for people who otherwise wouldn't have the chance to come to school or stay in school. It's helped me a lot. I'm always transferring, so pretty much thankful for everybody who's a part of the program. If it wasn't without this program, you know, I probably wouldn't be here at this time. Um, I was really going to, like, drop out of school. A lot of times, foster youth are very lost in their life. You know, they go through the system, they fall through the cracks, and they don't have that family support system or any other support system to really rally behind them. Without them, without them for the help of getting my paperwork, I probably wouldn't be at this time. It's given and the motivation for people to keep trying even though their life factors may affect their school life. Really thank, thank them for like giving me here. I'm, I'm already completing my first year in college and one more to go and without them it wouldn't be possible. And this program, just the fact that it exists is, you know, it really is a gateway into providing those type of youth with a support system to be able to have a better outlook, a more positive outlook with their life and focus on their education because education really is the key to, you know, to having a better life. Thank you, Goddard College, for everything you guys have done for me.
I'm so excited to have all these folks here. It's been a great year. It's going to be another great year next year. You know, there's a, a big foster youth population here at Valley College, about 400 or so. So our target is to reach out to all of those students and let them know that we're here, let them know that we're supporting them. Check us out. Uh, Dorian just made this nice cell phone case for herself, right? She says if you're interested in it, she can help you make it or she can sell you one also if you want to represent on campus, right? Keep it OG. We're here to kind of see them along the way from the moment they enroll into Valley College until they transfer or graduate. That's why we're here. That's what we want to see and that's what we want to be a part of. And I think all of us can agree that, that one of the main focuses is to be that support system that a lot of these students need in order to get to that next step in their life. I made a tablet case too. I, I'll sell them for 12 bucks a piece. I think that these group of students are inspirational, they're resilient, a population that is on the rise to change the world for the better. You never give up and never take no for an answer. It's our Snapchat email number. And feel free to share any photos that you would like us to share on our Instagram page. We'll be more than happy to share the inspiration. It's LABC underscore Guardians Comics.